What is the acceleration of an object on Earth when thrown in the air? What is acceleration? Acceleration is the rate of change of velocity. So when on Earth, an object will be influenced by the Earth's mass. And when you drop something from the air, everything drops at the same acceleration. And that acceleration happens to be 9.8 meters per second square. But we usually round it up to 10 so we can conceptually understand the effects of gravitational acceleration on an object easier. So when an object drops from Earth, it will speed up and the velocity will change at the rate of 10 every second. So that means if you drop from rest with zero velocity, each second the speed will increase by 10. So after one second, it'll be 10 meters per second. After two seconds, it'll be 20 meters per second. After three seconds, it's going to be 30 meters per second because each second, the object will increase its speed by 10. If an object is dropped from rest, what is its speed in 5 seconds? Since the speed increases by 10 every second, in 5 seconds, the speed of the object will be 15 meters per second. The highlight of this video is gravitational potential energy. U in this formula stands for the potential energy. So why is it called potential energy? It's called potential energy because the higher you are at, the more kinetic energy you'll have when you hit the ground. Okay, so if you drop at a higher location, you have the potential to speed up more because you're gonna have a longer time to drop. And as you well know by now, the higher the speed, the higher the kinetic energy. So you have the potential to have a higher kinetic energy when you hit the ground, when you're at a higher location. So the potential energy depends on height. Let's examine this very important equation, U is equal to mgh. U stands for potential energy. The letter U stands for potential energy. And H represents the height. M stands for mass in kilograms. And G stands for the gravitational acceleration, which happens to equal to 10 meters per second square. If an object with a mass of three kilograms is about to drop from 20 meters from the ground, what is its potential energy? The mass is three kilograms. The height is 20 meters. To calculate the potential energy, which is represented by the letter U, you have to multiply the mass to G, which is always 10, and then to the height. Okay, so, you'll, so you multiply the three kilograms that was given in the problem, times 10, times 20 meters, which represents the height that the object was located. And finally, let's not forget the unit. The unit for energy happens to be joules. So we write J.